Okay, hello guys. My I'm, my voice might sound a little weird for a little bit. I just woke up. Um, so I'm sorry about that. If my voice sounds kind of funky. I'm a little congested. If I have to cough, I'll try to turn away from the mic. But I can't promise anything. <clears throat> it's been a rough couple days. Um... I'm doing okay today. I hope everybody's doing good. I'm sorry I was gone for a few days. I don't know how long was I even gone. I don't know, but it's been at least like three days, three, four days. Somebody probably knows, I don't. <clears throat> it's like almost 11 p.m. for me right now. But... I, like, I have energy, sort of. I'm gonna stream while I have energy. You know? I'm gonna join a small public server. You guys are welcome to join. For a little while, I'm just gonna play the hunt event thing. Because I haven't played it yet. I waited till I was streaming to play it. <clears throat> but, um... We're just doing Wild Horse Islands today. <clears throat> if I play Horse Life, it'll be during a different stream. Oh my gosh, I'm so congested. Hold on. Let me get something to let me get a wad, something to drink really quick. <clears throat> hey, I'm Caster. Can you get me a pin message, please? Even just like a simple one. Okay. <clears throat> Never to the breeding hub by using the boat or talking. Francine on mainland. Okay, so you can use Francine to get there. That's kind of nice. Hang out with other players, breed your horses at a reduced fee and cooldown. I wonder how much the cooldown is reduced, if that's even worth it. The hunt is on. Enter the neon portal on mainland. The neon circuit race. Okay. I've already seen the black rainbow horse and. It's something. It's something. I don't. I'm not the biggest fan of it. Okay. <clears throat> Thank you, Caster. <clears throat> Again, I'm sorry if I'm coughing a lot. I'm still technically sick right now. Um. I also- I- I can't tell if I'm coming out of depression or going back into depression. Because, like, the- like, a major warning sign of the, one of those two things happened yesterday. I- I went from sleeping all- like, I- I slept for like a good 12 hours and then stayed up for 36 hours straight. And I only slept like six hours. <clears throat> so. I mean, I've been in a pretty bad depression for a little while. So I'm hoping that like, I'm finally getting out of it. Ow, that's really bright. Did I turn down my settings? Am I ever gonna- am I gonna regret this if I go in here with my settings turned up? Uh, well, I guess we'll find out. Kinda scared. Ooh, that's getting turned down. Okay, and the brightness thing does not affect it. Saturation doesn't affect it. Well, it kind of does. Okay, well, I'll have to fix all of my settings later. But this makes it bearable, at least. Oh, I'm sliding. 
I feel like I'm in like... You guys know... I'll turn up the saturation a little bit. In contrast, so it doesn't look stupid. Do you guys know the, um... What is it? I don't like that. I'm, I gotta turn that... I'm turning that back down. Do you guys know those, like... They're not Legos, but they're like the kids' version of Legos. Like, something duplex or something, I think, is what it is. Like, you know those things? It looks like a world made out of those. Duplos, I think, yeah. It looks like they constructed this world out of those. So I'm guessing this is the race. <clears throat> so let's do this, I suppose. I don't know if Ken's gonna be good for this. I mean, to be fair, it's kind of, like, not super obvious. It's just, like, a little portal. And that's it. I mean, I could see how you could walk past it. Why am I streaming so late? Because my sleep schedule is destroyed and I'm sick right now. You will be speedy. Okay, thank you for the warning. Like, I admit, this is pretty neat. It's very unique. It's, you know, it's not something I've seen. Like, there's not a similar environment. Oh, yeah, here's the speedy part, I think. <clears throat> it's not an environment that I've seen in Wild Horse Islands before. But it still feels, like, slightly out of place. Which, I mean, makes sense, because it's supposed to be, like, a Roblox-wide event. Like, I don't hate it. But I don't love it. So, you know. Yeah, I wouldn't be shocked if it gives you a headache. <clears throat> Let me see. I'm gonna... I'll... My game is gonna look, like, really depressed for a little bit. But hopefully this will help with any headaches or anything like that. Cause I don't wanna... I don't wanna hurt your guys' eyes. I know my eyes are kind of sent. Oh my gosh. Wild Horse Islands looks like a horror game now. Like, I feel like I just walked into, like, an apocalyptic town. I'll keep this in mind if I ever need, like, an apocalyptic setting for an edit. <clears throat> oh, wait, wrong way. Oops. Whee! It does look really cool for horror ambience, and it actually makes the, uh, like, the neon world reasonable. Like, it doesn't hurt my eyes. Um, you just do the race over and over, and I think you have a chance to get a horse. That's what I've seen, at least. It's not, like, that interesting. I didn't expect it to be that interesting, because it's, like, a Roblox-wide event. There's tons of games. That have like events with it. I will say this is good practice for like um No! <laughs> okay, well I'm I'm losing the race now. I tried to get sneaky with it. And ended up getting completely missing it. That's fine. As long as I beat it, that's all that matters. I have my brightness turned down because this world hurts my eyes really bad. Okay, nothing yet. I need- to, I want to get one horse. At least. And then I'm fine. I just want to get at least one. I don't want to spend too long in this world because I can see this giving me a really bad headache if I'm not careful. And I I don't really need that on top of that the hell I'm already not feeling very good. I'm going to stand in the front this time. I keep getting stuck in the back. It doesn't give a notification. Oh, it doesn't. Okay, I'll leave my inventory on newest then, so I could find one if I do get one. Ooh. 
took you 42 runs. Oh my gosh. I'm I'm probably gonna mess up majority of these races because I'm trying to read chat both in game and on stream chat while doing the race. I would the part where it speeds you up a bunch is pretty cool. This kind of reminds me of um the map kind of reminds me of something I'd see in like Mario Kart. If you if you know what I mean. Like kind of doesn't it like i could see this being like a mario kart map just if you take out the jumps okay nothing i'm, I'm gonna guess my luck is gonna be pretty bad and i'm not gonna get like a horse anytime soon i just need to get one just one that's all i that's all i want just one. If I can get just one, I'll be happy. Like, I think there's a pop-up if you have, like, certain settings on, but I could be wrong. I watched Nick stream it a little bit when it first came out. Because it came out and I was like... I like, was laying there barely awake and I'm like, I'm not getting on the play it right now. I've had a rough couple of days, but... Hi, Tingo. Like, there is something I want to try today, but I don't know if that's going to happen because it's going to be a little complicated. Like, I'd assume there's not a pop-up in the in-game chat. But I would assume it gives you, like, a thing at the bottom of the screen saying, like, oh, plus black rainbow horse or whatever it's called. Because, like, that would make sense. But I don't think I can see it being a giant hassle that popped up in the in-game chat. Nothing for me yet. But I want to try something, right? For my little my little BBA dressage team. I don't know if I can get enough people online for it, but I'll definitely try. Oh, nice. I, I'm fine with whatever I get, because whichever one I get, I'm probably going to turn it into a forever full. So... But I want to try making, like, I don't know if you guys have ever seen them, but, like, you know the SSO, like, dressage edits? Where they do, like, they, they get some fancy angles and then, like, edit it to have, like, velocity or things like that. I want to try something like that. I just need to get, like, a few people that have, like, the right horse and pack, and I want to try that. I just don't know how many people are actually going to be on for that. So I don't know if we're going to... If if we have enough people, we'll try that. If not, then we'll go from there. If not, I'll just probably chill because my stomach hurts really bad. I tried this drink from Dutch Brothers and it was really good, but it made me so much more sick. It was really good, but I regretted it really badly. Still nothing. Your dream black rainbow breed. I mean, I... Probably none of them. I'm not the biggest fan of them from what I've seen. Maybe they'll grow on me. Maybe. But I doubt it. So I'm probably just gonna make a forever full one. And that's it. <laughs> and all the other ones I'll probably just give to my friends. On, yeah, I'd be really cute on the V1s, but sadly we can't, you know, we can't get a V1.
like this race is structured really nice where you can get some like good shortcuts if you try you just got to be really careful with like those parts with the jumps that you can get stuck on Wow, I actually beat you guys, finally. Almost always somebody <laughs> somebody got in front of me. I finally beat you guys. I got first place. Well, if I get a thoroughbred one, you can have it, Tango, because I'm not gonna- I'm not gonna probably keep any of them. So if I get one, Tango gets first dibs on it. I'm gonna wait for that one to end. How many runs are you on? I already forgot a thing, like, E4? I haven't got a single horse yet. I just need to get a horse to turn into a full. I don't care if it's like a quarter horse, an appy, teke. I just need at least one to turn into a full. And that's it. That's all I really need. Because I don't want to spend longer in here than I have to. Because even with all the colors and stuff turned down, eventually this will give me a headache. Uh, yes, Ken's birthday is coming up. We got like another month still. His birthday is April 18th, and we'll probably throw him a birthday party unless I'm sick that day. Which I'd hope I'm not sick, but, you know, we can't really control that. He's gonna be two years old. Well, I say two years old. He was already an adult when I got him, but he's two years old. I'll have him in my inventory for two years. I haven't done the egg hunting warrior cats yet. I did like one parkour one. Actually, no, I did two obby ones. That's it. That's the only ones I've done so far besides the Wild Horse Islands one. Because I've just, I've barely been on my computer the last couple days, if I'm being completely honest. Like, the ones I'm worried about the most is the ones that involve combat. Because I saw multiple gun games in the egg hunt, which is scary. Because I'm not very good at those. Well, at least not by my standards. I think I'm okay at gun games, but I'm not, like, if there's any, like, pro players in there, I'm just... I'm done for it. As I'm not gonna be able to do anything. Like, note to self, don't bring Tango with me when doing the gun game ones. Because Tango is would just obliterate me if they're on the other team. Still no horse. You versus NPCs. Okay, Arsenal one won't be bad then. I think Arsenal had in mind, like, the, the younger players and stuff like that. Tango is scary good in gun game. I am not. I let Tango be the scary one, and I'm just, I mind my own business, because I'm not. I don't want to get in Tango's way, because that's just, I'm going to die. Note to self, though, if you are playing a gun game, and you need people for your team, you should bring Tango. If you're going against Tango, run. Oh, I can imagine. The simulators are probably a nightmare. All the trails are lagging my game so bad. <laughs> There's so many people doing the race all at once. It is kind of satisfying, though, to see all the trails move. 
It's also very laggy though. My stomach hurts, and I think it's potentially because of the world. Because I'm starting to realize that I get motion sick. Like, it's not like really, really bad. But if I'm already not feeling good and I play something that has like very quick motions, or bright colors are mixed, it can make me really nauseous. I don't know why they made the world so bright. They made it like bright neon and oh my gosh. Like this is, with mine, all of my brightness settings and contrast settings and everything like that are at zero and it's still bright. Yeah, you guys are free to go to my island. Unless my island is locked, you guys are free to go over there anytime you want. Ooh, nice. I've seen only a couple people get horses, at least that have announced it in chat. Should I race with sesame seed? You should race with whatever horse you want, because I think no matter what horse you use, it's not going to make that big of a difference. So just pick your favorite horse and, and do that. Like, it sh this, if this says anything, this is what mainland looks like right now. Mainland looks dead. Like, mainland looks dead and abandoned. And then you go in the neon world and it's still bright. Even with all of my settings turned down. I love rhythm games. I think I'm gonna enjoy that. Fun fact, um, before Wild Horse Islands, my uh, rhythm games were my main thing I played on stream. I played Friday, uh, I played Funky Friday is the one I played most of the time. Oh, I hate Flee the Facility. It sets off my flight or fight response so bad. The only time I like flew the facility is when I'm the beast, because I like to bully people. Thank you for the sub, I appreciate it. Oh! I got one! I got a quarter horse! All right, you, my child, are gonna be the one who gets babyified. Well, not bully people, like, literally, but, like, bully people in a game setting. Like, chase them around and knock them down like you're supposed to and flee the facility. I'm not gonna actually bully people. I'm not, not that kind of person, but... I'll come back to that later because I need a break from that. I could bring my- I could bring life back to mainland again. Hold on. Yippee! Okay. Oh! I like their hat! They look very adorable. Okay, let's see. 
I do want to check out the breeding hub. And I want to see how much of a difference the breeding cooldown is. Because I, I saw the pricing difference and it really, the pricing difference isn't worth it at all. Like, if you're just worried about the price, you might as well just do it on mainland. Because it's like a 5% difference. There's like hardly any difference. So here's what we're gonna do. I have multiple sets of the same horses. Are you guys off? They should be off cooldown. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna breed one set of horses here, and then we're gonna go to the breeding hub and breed the other. There's no cooldown at all. Like no cooldown at all. That sounds too good to be true. Okay, hold on. Let's go to the boat, because I don't see, like... There's no cooldown? Oh my gosh. I'm gonna be so mad if you guys are messing with me. I'm gonna be really mad if you guys are messing with me. Oh my gosh. That's... If you guys are lying to me, I'm gonna be so mad. <laughs> you better not. Okay, this is kind of cute. Cute little area. Francine's breeding center. I feel like I'm about to walk into like a mega mansion. This is cute though. Oh, wow. This would be so good for roleplay stuff. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. If only, if only you could toggle wild mode in here. If only. Okay, I don't talk to you still. You still don't have a job anymore. All right, you. And, um, okay, that one might work. I don't know. Is my thing off? Let me turn that off. Let me, let me turn that off. You guys weren't lying to me. Oh my gosh. Hold on. I think I found my new favorite island. I think I found my new favorite island. Let's go! And we got another BBA horse. Uh, I don't have any pearly orange accessories that I'm aware of. And if I do, they're probably in use. Hold on. Let me see what I have here. I am so happy. That's the one thing I've hated about breeding for so long. And another one? And another one? Hold on. Oh my gosh. Francine likes me today? Francine likes me today? I... Wow, I can't believe that. Come on, give me something bad. You can't you're just messing with me. What personality does it have? What? So, okay, for the person who asked what BBA is, it's a riding club that I own. And right now, I'm trying to breed, like, official show horses. And I have very specific criteria for what I'm going for. And I've been having trouble for ages trying to get the right horses. 
And I just got three in a row. I'm just in shock. Like, what? My inventory's full. <laughs> I should have seen that coming, honestly. Oh, that's probably why. I never cleared out my inventory from last time I went horse hunting. I d Is it VIP players only? I don't know. That's an OG stat one. Okay. There we go. Now I have space again. Let's go back over here. So I need 10 of the white Frisians total. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. I need two more. What are the odds we get the last two we need today? Probably not very good odds. But you never know, right? You never know. Ivory. And... Okay. Even if I get a black Frisian, that's useful. Personality. If you get an MM, I'm, I, don't, I don't know what I'm gonna do if I get a mismatch, I can't lie. You know what this means though? I can finally bring back the breeding series because it's not gonna be a nightmare to record it anymore. Ooh, this is a tough one. Okay, if I get the wrong one, I can just auction this off. It still works. I think that's every BBA horse we need. I think that's literally every single BBA horse that we need for Team Velvet. Well, Team Velvet's done. Francine, what do you want from me? Because you're never this nice. What do you want from me? I've already given a lot to you, Francine. You already took multiple of my moderator's body parts. I'm pretty sure I sacrificed my firstborn child to you. Um, I've, I've given a lot to Francine. She wants her job back. Oh, that's a good point. She probably does want her job back. I don't know, Francine. We'll see. We'll see. Now let's see. Will Francine be nice enough to give me the other Frisians I need? Okay, not a good start. Right horse, wrong personality. Okay. What if we try getting the perch run that I uh, one of the perch runs that I need? No, we didn't get the right one. What do we get? Oh, you're definitely going to be auctioned. Okay, maybe it's just the white Frisians. Maybe she's just only giving me good luck with the white Frisians. Who just bashed me into a wall? <laughs> what just happened? Okay. Nightmare's Fury. And... This OG Frisian. 
closing jet. That one works. Okay, I'm running out of Frisians here. Okay, let's try. What if I do a Marwari and a Black Frisian? I feel like I'm probably gonna get the Legacy Coat because it's like a curse. Oh, wrong personality, but right horse. Okay, I'm very quickly running out of options here. I think you're OG too, yeah. Oh. Okay, well, it's still cute. Not what I was going for, though, and it should be OG stats. I mean, honestly, I'm cool with it giving doubles of one of the parents. Because that helps me out greatly, if that's the case. Hold on, is there a box around here that I can grab? Where's the storage box? Is there one inside? I'm guessing- oh, there it is, okay. Woo, that's some bad lag. Do I have any BBA horses stored in here? Only TVs. Okay, what about... Okay, I have a bunch of fail Frisians in here. You know what I think we should do? Francine, come here. Rest in peace, 20k, but it'll be worth it. Because you know what? Also, wait, no, it doesn't always give duplicates of the other parents because this one has flax and fade, and the parent that it has the coat and breed of didn't have flax and fade. So it just seems like the normal breeding, except for maybe there's like a slightly higher chance to get a duplicate of the parent. Or maybe it is slightly broken and it's just like only breaks sometimes. Please don't kick people. It's not very kind of you. I'm sorry to the person my foal just kicked in the face. I'm sure they're very apologetic. All right. Wrong personality again. So the personalities are still kind of randomized. So that means... Now I'm gonna grow up the other foals really quick too. Like the fail foals too. I'm very happy. I thought you guys were just messing with me when you said there was no cooldown, but I think it just it sounded too good to be true. Okay, bam. And any eventually, once I'm done getting all the horses I need, I'm gonna have so many. And I really mean so many OG stat Frisians and Pertrons to, to, to get rid of. Like an unreasonable amount.
You guys met like to mess with me. You guys have on plenty of occasion. I have a reason to be skeptical when you guys are telling me something that sounds way too good to be true. Wrong personality! Okay. It's fine. I'm fine. Not mad at all. Not mad in the slightest. Not at all. Not in any way. Oh, you're cute. Oh, you're the right personality, but I don't need any more of you guys. It's always the personalities that mess it up. Like... It's... It's so obnoxious, but you know what? It happens. You know what I just realized? Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Is this always been like this? Am I just stupid? I'm using two different Frisians with two different coats, and it doesn't say I have an ab ability to get a common coat. Has that always been like that? Or like... It has? Okay, I guess I just haven't noticed. I surely have more Frisians in my locker. I wouldn't be surprised. Let me go look. Certain coats are like that. The breeding system is kind of weird. The breeding system's always been weird. You guys want to see how many Frisians I have in here because of this? All of the V2 Frisians, especially all the white and black ones, all of those are from fail breedings. <laughs> You're a black reverse apple. Do I not have any, like, plain black Frisians? Hold on. Where's the color thing? I'm pretty sure literally every single one of them is on cooldown. Except for that little guy. You can grow them up. But then I think I'm pretty much out of Frisians. Okay. Yeah. Grab this little guy. All right, we have like one more shot at this. Let's do, hold on, I'm gonna do it by newest again. Newest. We're gonna do it with this white Frisian. So we have a 50-50 chance to get one of the two. The white Frisian, wrong personality. Yiffy, what a good final. Pairing. Oh, I'm gonna have so many Frisians to get rid of. <laughs> I'm gonna have so many Frisians to get rid of. Okay, now I gotta go through the painstakingly long and annoying process here. Of, hold on, first let me get away from the crowd so we're not like crowding other people. Let's go hide in the storage room. Well, I say hide very lightly. Oh, is that little heart like Matt? That's kind of cute. I'm just gonna grow up everything and then. Oh, that's a scammer. Hold on. Don't listen to that person, guys. That is a Robux scam. They are very clearly here to bother me on stream, so just ignore them, guys. Okay, let me grow everything up, and then we'll start labeling everything. 
These will all go towards an auction, so. Okay, um, I think that's every- every single foal we've bred is grown up now. Let's get to labeling. OG auction. OG. All the ones- all the white Frisians that don't match now are just gonna get auctioned off because I don't need them. Oh, wait, you're OG, right? Yeah, okay. OG. Um, I think your OG stats too. Oh, bar. OG. You are also OG auction. Hold on, let me... Go ahead and grow this guy up. We're gonna- I'm gonna need him for other stuff too. Yeah, let me just copy that so I can paste it, because some of these I'm at the overwrite. Let me look up OG. Put that away. I still need the black coat Frisians, so they're not gonna go yet. Yeah, we let Pockybot out of jail, finally. He, he got bailed out. Okay, let me pick this guy up. But I'm hoping to eventually do another auction. But I want to prepare first. What did Pockybot do? Um, a lot of things. A lot of things. Quite a few things. Let me store... I'm pretty sure I have other stuff for an auction stored on one of my alt accounts. My storage is full, hold on. Let me see the Percherons really quick. Let's handle our Percheron problem. <laughs> we have quite a few Percherons. We're gonna have to handle that at some point. Um, Literally, okay, you see all of these Black Pento Percherons? Every single one of these is OG stats. I got every single one of these within a day. I don't need a single one of these. Well, I'm grabbing all of the Pertrons that have, like, good personalities. That should be OG stats. And then I'm gonna look up Black Reverse Dapple. And I'm gonna grab all of the stinkies that are in here. Alright, let's do some more breeding. Let me, let me find a different stall to do this at. That's not as cool. Okay. Let's go ahead and start working here. So, I'm gonna grab... Are, like, all of them male? I think majority of the Pertrons are male. Alright. We're aiming for black reverse dapple Pertrons. This is gonna be great, isn't it? <laughs> 
This is gonna be great, isn't it? Immediately, we got another Black Pento one. This is gonna go so great, isn't it? Oh, breeding also has no cooldown. <gasps> oh, okay. I'll have to keep that in mind. Oh, that's a thoroughbred baby. Okay. Much as I hate the Clydesdales. No, it's a Clydesdale. It's at least ha okay. At least has the right personality. Okay. Well, darn. But you know what? It's better than the last one. So, I'll give it that. Um, Pertron. Bam. Okay. The Frisian, isn't it? It's a Frisian. It has the right personality, though. This Clydesdale. This Pertron. Bam. Okay, we didn't get one this time. It's a baby perch. Alright, let's see. How many more do we have left? It's not looking like that many. Okay. And I'm gonna use... Ooh. I don't really have any other good ones. I guess I'll just do... Are you OG stats? R. Okay. Please. No! <laughs> no! The wrong personality! Okay, well... At least gives us another chance. Oh, we're going back to the locker. I need more Perdrons. Let me grab some more of them. Let me put some of them back. We'll use this one because, like... I'm trying to reduce the amount of... <laughs> The amount of black pertrons that I have. Not black pertrons, uh, the black pinto ones. Here, hold on, let me put some of the pertrons back in here really quick. I'm not, I'm, I really just want to get these Percherons done so that I can get rid of this, like, cluster of uh, Black Pinto Percherons that I have. Hold on, I gotta find ones that have, like, bond with them. After a while, I just kind of, like, gave up and stopped throwing them up. I have 171 forever goals right now. It'll get probably closer to 500 eventually, but we're slowly approaching 200. Here, hold on. I need to... Let me grow up these guys really quick. I might need to buy more potions. I'm not even gonna bother growing up the ones that don't have the right coat. Okay. And then let me grab golden apples. 
And we're gonna bond with the Pertrons. This one needs bond. I think all the other ones are good. It was like just that one. Yeah, okay. Let's do some more breeding. I'm just gonna keep doing this until eventually I run out of horses to actually breed. Like, I'm not just gonna breed random horses. I only have so much money that I wanna spend today. This one I'm gonna breed with another Pertron. And hopefully. Oh, we didn't get the right coat. It's Black Pinto, isn't it? Oh, look at that! And it's the right personality, because of course it is! Oh my gosh. I feel like Francine really doesn't like me sometimes. Just a hunch that Francine might not like me. You know, it's another Black Pinto Percheron, isn't it? Oh no, it's a Black Pinto Clydesdale. At least, at least it didn't give me the right personality. I would have been mad if it did. Alright, let's see. This Percheron and this Frisian. Nope. Let me get a Black Pinto. Oh! Look at that! And it's the right personality! It's so great! It's so great, isn't it, guys? This is absolutely amazing. Oh, look at that! It's another- Another black pinto percheron with the personality I need. Okay, well this one was just a complete failure. Jeez, okay. I'm gonna move stalls because people are get starting to block the view of the full, which isn't ideal. I think this is- yeah, that's a black forest apple. Oh boy. I feel like- I'm pretty sure the black pinto pertrons are just a curse at this point. Any luck? We got really good luck at the beginning. And now my luck is just being absolutely horrible. Do I even have any more? I have two more. And I'm pretty sure I'm out of Pertrons that are female, that have OG stats. Okay, let's go grab a couple female OG stat Pento Pertrons, and then we will do that. All right, Pertron. I'm gonna put a couple of these guys in the locker. By a couple, I mean majority of them. Do I have any female ones off cooldown? You're off cooldown. You're off cooldown. You're a man. Okay. And that's all we can do right now, I'm pretty sure. Because I, I didn't get any more... I didn't even get any, like... Reverse like dapple pertrons so it's like okay so you this is black reverse dapple okay bam it's a marwari okay well darn at least it's cute and then this will be our last one for now because i've also probably spent i've spent a lot of money already, too. Alrighty, and this is our last one. And we didn't even get the right coat. Okay, well. It's another Black Pendo Pertron! Oh, yay! It's exactly what I wanted. Oh, 
I'm gonna prematurely close chat. I'm pretty sure that person's back. Could be wrong though. No. Alright, I'm gonna throw some of these guys back in the locker. The free up inventory space. I really need to do something about the black pento bird, you're on. Just the black pento races in general. Look at this! What am I gonna do with this many black pinto horses? What do I do with this? There's so many. Okay, I have one OG Arwari off cooldown. I'm doing that. I don't trust that person at all. All right, let's see. They are a boy, I believe. Yep, all right, and what code are we gonna try to get on him? Ken Coat? I think it's, I think it's fair if we try Ken Coat. Let's try Ken Coat. I'm gonna use- let's use Karen. Karen will give us good luck. Maybe. It's another black pinto! <laughs> another black pinto! Can't you tell how happy I am? I say as I- my eyes start to water. I'm not crying, I promise. I just have very sensitive eyes. Well darn. That's just great, isn't it? Alright, let's try Clara next. Actually, no, 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 no. We're gonna try Ivory. Are you really? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me? If someone is spamming the chat, just block them and ignore them, because I'm pretty sure it's the person I already blocked, because I figured this would happen. Alright, let's try Clara. I- This is stupid. This is stupid. This is stupid. What is this? At least it has a different personality and gender this time. Yeah, there's like, it's either scammers or spammers or stream snipers. One of one of those. I don't know who, but there's somebody trying to cause issues in chat. So I'm just blocking them before it can get out of hand. All right, let's use the boom. And it's just a Ken. Okay. It's just a baby kaboom. He just duplicated himself. Oh, I dropped below a million, but that's okay. Kaboom Jr. And he should have OG stats, yeah. OG stats almost 100%. Yes. He's almost 100% purebred, and he's OG stat. OG stat. I didn't mean to capitalize the L. Like, I made Kaboom specifically for event horse hunting so now i have baby kaboom which i'll probably just i'll probably auction off to be honest uh, you guys are free to take screenshots if you want 
but I can't do individual screenshots during stream because it gets too out of hand. I should probably get on a horse so I'm not being stepped on. In a second, where's Ken? Where is the boy? I can't find him. I'm gonna close chat since I'm done reading. Fully started. Oh, that's nice. Congratulations. You have any IUHs? Yes, I do. I have 11, I think. I was so used to saying 10 and then I got another one recently. I didn't catch any of them. I'm not, I'm not like Tamaria lucky, but. Also, I never got my cranberry juice open. I was too tired. My hands were too weak. I just never got it open. Come on. I'll get it open eventually. Just give me a little bit. I'll just, I'll stand here until I can get it open. Oh, let's go. Okay. The shirt trick always works. So, okay. I don't know if this will work for anybody else, but anytime I have a hard time opening, like, a juice or anything that has, like, like, you know, like, the little ridges on the cap that hurt if you pull on them too hard? Like, those kind of caps. If you're not able to get a good grip, wrap the bottom of your shirt around it and twist back and forth for a few seconds and then try again and it works, like, every time. I just did that and I got it open immediately. Like, I don't know. I learn a lot of really weird life hacks because I'm just- I'm terrible at exi- I'm terrible at existing. Like, does that make any sense? Holy auction be- I don't know. Probably not today, because I want to take plenty of time to, um, you know, I want to take as much time as I can to get as much stuff as possible before I do an auction, which I'll auction on stream. It'll be an on stream auction, but it's not going to be today on stream. I'm sorry if I accidentally block anybody. That actually didn't do anything wrong, but since somebody's messing with me in game, I'm just blocking anybody I find suspicious. I'll unblock everybody after stream, but. I don't know when the auction would be. I don't. I feel better. Still not top tier, but I felt okay enough to stream tonight. So let's start, right? Um, I'm gonna quickly, I'm curious.
Oh, I'm setting that off really quick. Ah, coin cloud. Oh, and I got you, I got you. I'm gonna take a guess and say that my suspicions against that person were correct. Yeah, if somebody is spamming something in chat that is inappropriate, simply block them or ignore it. They just want reactions out of people, which is why anytime I see see them join on a new account, I just immediately block it because I'm not dumb. I'm seeing if I can get enough people to record a funny little thing with me. It's normal, it doesn't bother me at all. Hey, um... I'm gonna ask this in chat too, because not everybody's in the BBA Discord server. Is there anybody who has the BBA uniform and the Frisian in chat that I can, like, snatch into a voice chat in a few minutes? I figured you were a variable caramel. I don't know if anybody else is, because I need like at least a few people because I can't use myself. BBA unicorn. Yeah, no, BBA totally has unicorns. BBA right now, we're only doing meets with Discord until we fully open because this dressage is going to be discord only for the time being what is bba it's a writing academy that i own you guys are welcome to go to my island i am totally fine with that You just snag me later? Okay. Well, I'm gonna assume that I'll be up for a while. I don't know if I told you guys, but um, I was up for 36 hours straight yesterday. And then I slept for like six hours and I feel very rested. I feel wide awake. But at the same time, I don't know, man. I don't know. Like, No, let me zoom out a little bit, and I'm gonna do that. That way we can see everybody. Here, hold on. I- when did I wake up yesterday? Because I know- I- well, I say yesterday. I didn't wake up yesterday. I know I meant- I sent something in the Goofy server, and I said, like, I overslept just a little because I slept for, like, 12 hours straight. Oh yeah, here it is. I may have slept in just a little. I woke up at 9.30 p.m. on the 14th. I went to sleep Yes, I went to sleep today. Well, tomorrow, technically right now. It just hit midnight for me. But yesterday, 16th, I went to sleep at like... 3 or 4 p.m. And I woke up at like 10 p.m. And now I'm here.
The Roblox group is called Bunny Burrow, yeah, Bunny Burrow Academy. I cannot speak. Hold on. I'll get a link. Uh, it's on join request only, but I am going to go through and accept join requests and stuff like that soon. There you go. Boop. Speaking of, I also need to check join requests for my main group, too. I'm just kind of hanging out to see if I can get enough people for this. Um, Tango and Evan. I think you guys have the uniform and stuff. Are you guys free? If not, I can provide, but I just don't want to provide to like complete strangers kind of thing. I'm gonna- I don't know if Evan's listening in still or not. Um, right now we don't have player uniforms it's just horse uniforms so i want to try making a little edit thing so i'm trying to get people who already have all this stuff or people i'm close to to help i need like three or four people at least if i can get tango caramel and evan i'll be good emily options open to you as well i could provide this stuff for you Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let me... Okay. I'm gonna drag you guys into... I think... Okay, everybody... Tango, Carmel, Emily, Evan, any of you guys that want to participate in the little dressage thing, join a random VC in Bunnyboro Academy and I'll pull you into the private one. Just make sure to be muted. Okay. Well done. Uh, what's their username? Uh, someone in stream chat, what's the person's name so I can block them? Because I'm not going to open chat to check. They left, I'm pretty sure. They probably got banned. We're about to probably hop to a private server anyway, so that's not the end of the world. Also, yes, right now, because I'm just kind of standing here right now. I'm just waiting to get enough people, and then I'm going to do that. Yeah, like, sadly, I can't do anything about that. If I get demonetized or whatever because somebody's spamming... I can't do anything about that. I just kind of got to live with it, but it's fine. Uh, 
Okay, here. Here's what I'm gonna do. Uh, Emily. I'm gonna jump in my... Public VIP, assuming it's open right now. Yeah, it is. And I can get you the stuff and give you a little rundown. Hi, Evan. We'll come back to a public server in a little bit. What the heck? What's going on? Why did my taskbar duplicate itself? Um... Roblox duplicated my taskbar? Hold on. I don't know what's- I don't know what happened there. Kinda weird. You guys could see just how many things I have open when I stream. <laughs> See, now here's the thing. Where do we record? Do we do it at Training Island? Should we do it in the small arena in my island? Should we do it at the Breeding Hub arena? Uh, preferably stay muted for now, Evan, because we're using this to do uh, recording and stuff like that. And I don't want to have to adjust my stream stuff. Okay, I'll have to wait for everybody to get in here first, then to make sure that we all go at the same time in the event that it just decides not to put us in the same server. I don't know how they have the private server thing set up in here, but I don't want to risk it because it's one of the two. There's bleachers? I didn't check that out while I was there. There's bleachers? Oh my gosh. That's crazy. Hello? Okay. Hold on. I need to figure out which of these, um... Which of the BBA horses I want to give you? Which I'll need them back afterward. But I'm trying to give you one that doesn't have like a terrible personality here. I guess I'll just give you this guy. I hate how the chat blocks the accessory menu. It makes me very mad. Alright. Here. Or my stuff. Fun part's finding everything. See that one. Not that one. It's the fancy. Oh, hey, Evan. And then just the polos. Okay, that should be everything. It's a very simple outfit. Alright. If you forget to give back the accessories, I don't care. I just mostly need the horse back. Let me get Ivory out. Honestly, I don't know. It's just, it's really cool having a bunch of horses with all like the same outfit and stuff. Uh, Carmel, I'm gonna need to give you one of the actual BBA horses for this since we're filming.
Let me see. I don't have any that are maxed out that are like... Um... Let me go get some white dye. Give me a second. Actually, no, I have one that has white hair. I could just train him. Give me a moment. I do warn you guys, the next bit of stream might be a little bit boring, but it also might be really satisfying. So just like heads up. stomped on me did you guys see that she stomped on me twice and then turned around like she didn't do anything wrong one that one I love satisfying and boring. Well, I mean, like, it's it's a group dressage, so it's gonna be satisfying, even if it is boring. So I think we're just waiting on Tango. Also, Carmel, um, you might want to join the VC. Just join any random VC. I'll pull you in. In uh, in the BBA server. I have like a private recording VC for this stuff. Same with you, Tango. Whenever you're ready. Carmel has a lot of TBs, just like in general. Your VC is broken. Can you at least hear me? Okay, as long as you can hear me, that's all that matters. Okay, let's go, let's go to the training island really quick and we'll do some warm-ups. Because I think it's probably been a long time since Emily's done any of this. If Emily's even participated in dressage before, I don't remember. We're not doing anything crazy. We're gonna do some really simple moves. All right, Tango. Uh, we're gonna do like we're gonna film some little dressage stuff, and also chat's gonna get to watch, so it's gonna be pretty fun. Uh, no, we're just going to Training Island to do some warm-ups, and then we're gonna head to the Breeding Hub. We were just kind of waiting for you, so... 
Here, uh, Emily, if you want to come with me. Since Carmel's still tacking up. I'm going to show you. Basically, all I'm going to have us do, probably, at least for like the very basics, is one, just walking in a straight line, which I'm pretty sure you can probably do. You know, I think everybody can do that. Um, as well as we're going to be doing some curls, which is literally just that. That's all it is. You just spin in a circle and keep walking the direction you were before. Which we'll go more in depth once we actually get to the breeding hub and stuff because we got to make some adjustments based on like the area. But we're mostly just doing it for aesthetics. So if anybody messes up, we'll just keep doing it until we get it to look nice. My computer is going to be screaming and crying in a minute when I have to open OBS, too. <laughs> I wish they had more dressage moves, but you know what? We found a way to work with it. So you know what? It's fine. All right, here. Let's do a warm up with you three while Tango's getting situated. Here, Evan, I'm going to have you be the leader. Line up behind me and line up behind Evan. It's okay if it's not perfect. Focus more on lining up with Evan than me. All right. Evan, go ahead. Walk him around the arena. Just follow Evan at a walk. Try to make your spacing not too drastic. So, Emily, once you guys make it to the next wall, scoot up a little bit to catch up with Evan. A little more. A little more. Okay, that's pretty good. Because with dressage, the spacing isn't going to be as wide. Uh, NEVC and BBA. The BBA voice channels. And then Evan, cut it C. And there's our tango. All right. So, I want- Emily, I want you to try a curl, okay? When I call it. So when I- what I do when I call dressage moves, essentially, is I'll go- I'll say what move we're doing, then I'll say, Okay, ready, and go. And then whenever I say go, is when you'll do it. Or I didn't say anything. I know you're excited, but- but calm down, it's okay. Uh, Evan, once you get to corner diagonal, please. All right, so what we're gonna do is we're gonna curl. Okay, Evan, you missed the diagonal. Diagonal, next corner, please. Uh, Emily, scoot forward slightly. Yep, thank you. Evan, diagonal, you just walk diagonally across the arena to the point across from it. No, not right now, Evan. Evan, that's, do you know what the word diagonal means? Cut across at the corner. Turn, turn, Evan, Evan, okay, hold on. I'm leading, everybody get behind me. I don't think Evan knows what the word diagonal means. <laughs> get behind me, everybody line up behind me. Against the, against the fence, against the fence. Evan, a diagonal is you don't, turn to a straight line so when i say cut across that is straight across however at a diagonal diagonal would be whatever corner you get to next you turn and you head towards the opposite corner of the arena all right you got that you think you can Finish off the rest of this. I'm gonna have you turn to left and you're gonna cut at A. The link is probably expired. I need to update it. All right, we're gonna try a curl here in a few minutes. So a curl for Emily, who is still learning. 
as essentially you just do a complete rotation and continue walking the original direction. So just do your best. If you can't get it, it's okay. You can watch the other people as well. We're gonna do it left, so you're gonna turn left. All right, left curl, ready, and go. Perfect, absolutely perfect. I'm very proud of you, Emily. That was literally perfect. And goes lagging, uh-oh. <laughs> Beautiful. You guys did amazing. That was like, that was like scarily perfect. You guys did so good. All right. I'm going to try it. We're going to, when you get to the next corner, Evan, diagonal. And we're going to try right. Since I don't even think we need to do another left one. You guys did that flawlessly. Which, if it's not obvious, right curl is exactly the same as left curl, except for you turn right instead. Alright. Right curl. Ready and go. Absolutely perfect. Good job. All right. Uh, Evan, once you get there, left, cut at C. I don't think we're going to do really anything else crazy. I think we're mostly just going to do curls for the first bit. Curls and then walking along the arena. Are they so good at curls? Every person here... Except for Emily, has participated in multiple dressage lessons already. This is Emily's first ever lesson that she's attended. So I'm like, wow, I'm shocked. <laughs> Emily's just built different. Emily is just built different. Alright, Evan, uh, we're gonna head out of the arena and we're gonna head towards the docks. So just keep at a walk, walk towards the docks together. Which is also going to allow us to practice um, for, like, free-range dressage, in a way. Because at some point I would like to do, like, little dressage things that aren't trapped in an arena. So just follow the path, follow Evan, try your best to stay in a line. Uh oh, I'm guessing Carmel is typing. You're all good. This is just like a little bit of practice. It's not like the end of the world. All right, once you get onto the docks, you can break the line and just head towards. I forget his name, bald guy. William, I think his name is. And we're all gonna head to the breeding hub. See, like... With the dressage edit, it's going to fully depend, one, how well everybody executes the moves, two, how well I can edit it. Alright, we're missing Caramel. Yeah, I could see chat. I am just wasn't fully paying attention for a minute because I was teaching. Head up in here. Let's go check out the arena really quick. Once you guys load in, come up to the arena. You're lagging. You're you're all fine. You're all good. Once you finally load in and everything, just head in, head towards the arena. Oh, this is so nice. I love this. This is perfect. It's like the perfect size arena for a small dressage group, too.
Evan, Evan, this is gonna be perfect for competitions. Because we got the bleachers too. Now here's the real question. Oh. You can sit on them, there's just not many actual seats. Is not letting you? Is it not letting you teleport to the breeding hub? Uh, rejoin my public VIP and try again. Can't join private servers on your PC? What? I had that problem on mobile for a long time, but I've never heard of it happening on PC. Here, hold on. I'm gonna rejoin the public VIP. If you join me, does it bring you into the public VIP? The uh, rose crown and the tail rose are both from Abby's shop all year round. I'm just telling you guys now, dressage is a nightmare on mobile. Cause I don't know what's going on with my Roblox thing. It keeps like capturing my full screen for a second. All right. Join me. Try to teleport to the breeding hub. Yeah, it probably is pretty buggy. There's probably a lot of people online. Which is another reason I didn't want to try to record with a giant group or anything. But we chose to do a small group. Looks like Carmel disappeared from the server. I don't know if it's actually going to load him in, though. If it doesn't work, tell me in stream chat, please. I'm going to try something really quick. What if I try joining through somebody who's in the breeding hub right now? Will it drag me into that server? Or is it just going to be like, I'm in the breeding hub alone. Hmm... I'm trying to join through Emily and seeing if that does anything. I'm just- I'm seeing if this works first before I have everybody leave and do stuff. I'm seeing if I can join somebody who's in the breeding hub. Like, does it say I'm in game? Oh. Um. No, it just puts me in a random server. Okay. That's what I feared. All right, everybody rejoin the public VIP. We're going to send Carmel first and then everybody else is going to join. Oh, how do I change my ear? Okay, so with my ears. They are tracked with two different things. Um, one, my eyes. Two, my eyebrows. Whenever I blink, they wiggle. Oh, wait. 
Whenever I blink, they wiggle, but they also are controlled by my eyebrows. So if I... They perk up if I raise my eyebrows, and if I droop my eyebrows... So, that's pretty neat. Can wait for everybody to fully load in and everything. I don't know why joining the same server is so difficult, but it is. All right. Carmel, go ahead. Go to the breeding hub. Once we see you disappear, give us the confirmation that you are in the breeding hub and chat as soon as possible, and then everybody head to the breeding hub. Okay, everybody go. Breeding hub. Okay, everybody's in. Everybody's in. Head to the arena once you load in. That one was fast. What the heck? Okay. We're gonna do some uh, walking while I open up my stuff. Evan, you're our line leader. Come here. Everybody line up behind me. Okay, if it's not perfect, because once we're moving, it's gonna be easier to readjust. All right, Evan, go walk around the arena. You can cut across at points and stuff like that if you want. Just don't do anything too crazy. Just walking. Walking, cutting across diagonals. While I open my OBS. Okay. First things first. Let me make sure my mouse isn't being captured. All right, next. I'm gonna drop the brightness slightly. I'm gonna boost the shadow softness. I'm gonna bump up glow intensity. I don't know if that makes a difference. Saturation. I'm gonna turn it down a little bit. Contrast. Up a little bit. High quality is on. But there's not gonna matter really. When you hide overhead stats, does it hide it for everybody? I think it does. Uh, if you guys can, do me a favor and turn off your overhead stats. You can do that in the settings. I'm not worried about nicknames, just the overhead stats because it makes the name tag more like in your face. Okay, so I'm gonna have to discard my horse really quick. I'm gonna wait till you guys walk past, and then I'm gonna leave her over here, the hitching post. Because I am the cameraman. So please try not to trample me. I'm just gonna turn on the recording and then hopefully get some good shots.
All right, Evan, I'm gonna have you cut across at sea, please. If you trample me, it's not the end of the world. Don't try to avoid me. Pretend I'm not here. If they do, I'll 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 be fine. I'll recover. All right. Keep walking along the wall. I'm gonna come over here really quick. Oh, I need to like aim this. Okay, I might get trampled. It's okay. Just keep walking along the wall. Walk in a straight line, please. All right. I'm just trying to get a, a, a variety of shots and stuff I can use. Now let me just... Alright, I'm gonna have you guys cut across at B. And be ready, because we're going to do a curl. All right. Left curl. Ready. And go. Seven, we're going to diagonal. I gotta get in position here. Alright, we're gonna do another left curl. Left curl. Ready. And go. Slightly off timing there. All right, Evan, we're going to take left, cut at C. This is an actual club, yes. All right, left curl, ready, and go. Off timing. Um, and let's do, I'm gonna quickly pause. Let's do some tests really quick, see if anybody's, my voice is lagging. All right, Evan, either way, your choice. And we're gonna diagonal. Um, we haven't messed with trotting yet because that's like a whole nother thing to tackle. This is just like a little edit thing we're gonna do. Alright. Left curl. Ready. And go. Okay, it seems like everybody's hearing me at the same time. Just a matter of the turning. Left curl. Ready. And go. Okay, that one was flawless. All right, Evan, left, cut at C. You guys are probably actually gonna trample me this time. Just, I'm not here. I am merely a, I'm merely a fly right now. No, coins. All right. Right curl, ready, and go.
Okay, it's okay. We saved it. We saved it. We we saved it. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna have you guys do a comb. Which essentially what that is, is when I call it, you are immediately gonna turn away from the wall and cut across the arena. Like, you do not follow the person in front of you. You go on your own path, okay? Uh, Carmel, catch up. Little more. Emily, scoot up. Yep, good. All right. Comb, ready, and go. Oh, we hit a lag spike. It's okay. And when you get to the wall, you're gonna turn left. Evan stays in front. Alright, good job. Evan, can you scoot up slightly so you guys can space out? Carmel, scoot up. A little more. Emily, scoot up a little. Alright, there we go. I'm trying to keep you guys from, like, running into each other. Carmel's lagging pretty bad, though. Alright, Evan, we're gonna diagonal. And this time, I'm gonna aim myself kind of like this. All right, right curl, ready, and go. I think Evan's hearing me slightly sooner. Or either that or Evan's reaction time is just really scary. <laughs> All right, Evan, we're gonna take a right. Prepare for, we're gonna, we're gonna do another comb. All right, comb, ready, and go. Good job, very good job, very good job. And when you get to the wall, take a left, Evan stays in front. All right, let me, uh, you guys can just walk around the arena or you can come stand in the middle, whichever way you want to do. I'm going to see if I have enough footage to pull something off here. Which means desktop audio is going to disappear for a second while I open this up in CapCut. Evan, you good over there? I saw Evan slip. Um, let's see, do I have any audio from like older things I can use? Any audio. I'll use this audio. I'm about to turn off my thing for now. Okay, hold on, let me just do that, and then I'm going to slow down this clip.
Hold on, I'm trying to make this nice. I'm gonna see if I can finish this today. Everybody, everybody in game can keep you guys entertained by just bullying each other, whatever you guys are doing. Oh, that'd be cute, yeah. I'm trying to, like, cut out the bad parts. Oh, thank you for the dono! Oh my gosh! I really appreciate it. You should get a dancing bunny above my head here in a minute. It just might take a second. Okay. Did it show up? Because I don't know. Like, my notification thing isn't working. Like, my notification sounds on here are not working. For whatever reason. Do I have it turned down? Here, hold on. I might. Might be about to get my ears blasted out, but if not, then, uh, here, hold on. Can I re- It hasn't popped up on my feed yet. It'll take a second. Did my alert box break? Um, hold on. This is not the right thing, but for some reason it's not popping up, so here. I'll play it for you. It's not the right donation, but you can at least have the dancing bunny. It's not gone through yet, for whatever reason. Hold on, I'm trying to figure out what's... Is this the sound? Does this fix it? On. Yep, there it is. Okay. Finally. Thank you again, though. I really appreciate that. I'm sorry if it's a little quiet right now. I'm just checking to see if I have enough footage for an edit, and I think I do, so we should be good. Which means you guys get music back. All right, there we go. You guys having fun? <laughs> the heart in the arena is nice. It's very, it's very subtle. I like it.
You good there, Evan? You saw nothing. I'm just here to watch. I want to watch this chaos ensue. It's really funny because when other people get hit, they just fall over or they run a really fast in place like Tango is. Gosh, I have some stuff I need to work on adding to the BBA server too tonight before I forget about it. And also, Evan, I'm assuming when you said talking about BBA, that means you have something to talk to me about it after stream, I'm assuming. Okay. Let me go stomp on Evan really quick. <laughs> Hold on, I'm gonna see how I wanna see how many foals everybody has bred. Yes. I mean, it's not much worse than mine. I have like 1.5 thousand. That's honestly not that bad. I've already seen people with worse. Oh, yours is about the same as mine. Not that bad. Friendly guy for BBA. <laughs> That's great. Friendly guy. How do you join BBA? Right now we have both a Discord server and a Roblox group. The Discord server is the only one that's oper like in operation right now until we fully set everything up for Roblox only lessons. How's your week been? Majority of it has been me being sick. Which, when BBA is ready to be fully set in motion again, we will be posting stuff about it, and we will probably have, like, a trailer and stuff for it. Um, I can give you guys some information, though, if you're curious. I posted a little, ti little, little tiny bit of information. Um, when BBA reopens, we plan to have four disciplines at the start, and then we're going to be introducing more over time. Um, our four starting disciplines are going to be dressage, racing, equitation, and trail riding. And we have already multiple others planned that we just got to figure out the, the stuff for. Um, in the Roblox group, BBA, the wall is completely shut off right now because, you know, it's not functional. So, we have a lot of things to fine-tune still. It's mostly me working on it alongside Evan and Nyx. Um, and most importantly right now, we're trying to finish everything up, refix up the instructor's guide, and then we gotta start hiring instructors because that's gonna be the thing that's gonna bite us really bad if we don't prepare for it.
Um, instructors are like the teachers. So, like how a minute ago I was being like, okay, left curl ready and go and stuff like that and explaining the moves to them and things like that. I am an instructor. I was doing my job as an instructor while doing that. No, no, it's free. It's completely free. The only people who are going to have to spend money on this project is probably me. So you're fine. You're totally fine. It's completely free. Yes, I'm familiar with SSO. Um, the dressage for our group heavily takes after SSO dressage. Um, as well as I used to actively play it. I don't really play it much right now, but I have like life. I have Star Rider, Lifetime and all that stuff. Yeah, apparently getting depressed horses is rare. Yeah, a lot of it's heavily based off of moves from SSO dressage and things like that, because that's our best reference. Though, of course, a lot of things are changed for ease of, like, you know, for easiness for younger players, as well as, like, we had to make accommodations based on what's available to us in Wild Horse Islands. But right now we're trying to finish fixing up everything we need to. And then we're going to also try to hire some instructors. But I got to fix up the application for it and all that stuff. It's a giant mess essentially right now. And I'm trying to clean up said mess and make it functional again. Speaking of, hold on. Speaking of the application thing, I gotta, did I fix that already? I think I might've. Yeah, okay. Um, we don't have a club outfit right now for riders, but this is one of the outfits for the official dressage teams. Because for practice and stuff like that, we just let people have whatever. We just might ask for like a specific horse breed. Um, we're not worried about uniforms for practice, but when people are on the official team, we'll provide uniforms for them and things like that. What do you mean by hiring instructors? Essentially, think of it as like a volunteer job. We have them fill out an application. We look it over. If it fits what we're looking for and they meet the requirements, we will provide them with more questioning. Then if they pass that, they become an instructor, which means they can host lessons. So they can like post a lesson message and be like, okay, hey, I can take five people for a dressage lesson and they'll take those five people and teach them some basics of dressage or teach them whatever is supposed to be taught during that lesson so right now i'm like the headmaster one of the lead instructors evan is our other lead instructor which this is evan right here who's running away from me this is evan the rainbow lady She's our lead instructor. See you around ears. This is on Roblox. All of this is done on Roblox. Um, a lot of the behind the scenes stuff is done on Discord. So like... We're hoping to eventually have every discipline available to everybody without having to use voice communication. But for for the moment, dressage is going to be the only Discord only 
So people will have to be in a voice chat to do dressage for the time being until we can work around that and find a way to do it that works without voice chat. Everything else will be able to be taught. You'll be able to participate as long as you have Roblox. That's it. That's literally all you need. White Frisian is one of the dressage horses. Uh, there isn't really, but it's ideally 13 plus because that's how old you have to be to be in like public Discord servers and have Discord in general without a parent's permission. Uh, we have three, actually no, we have four planned different types of dressage horses. Uh, coat-wise. Breed-wise, we're gonna be using Perturons and Frisians, just because with their max stats, it's the ones that work best for a dressage. But trust me, I spent literally, like, hours testing that to see which horses would be the best for dressage. Frisian and Perturon were the two that came out on top. We might... Maybe have a Marwari dressage team at some point, too. Maybe. We'll see. But if we do, it'll be like beginner's dressage. Right now, the only requirement for instructors is hosting one lesson a week. But that might change. I don't know. Right now, we only expect our instructors to host one lesson a week, at the very least. Which obviously won't be necessary for a while until we actually have the group up and running again. Well, see, here's the thing. We already have 613 people in the group that want to participate. So... We got a lot to catch up on. Good night, Milo. Hello. I only have a, a baby, Leafy, sadly. Evan, do you remember the name of the Pertron teams? Because I don't. Team Title's one of the Frisian teams. I swear I had a list somewhere. Is it in me and Evan's DMs? No. Am I dumb? Where the heck? It's in a text document, isn't it? Hold on. Maybe not? I don't remember. All I know is one of the Pertron teams had like pink tack, I think. Or, like, pink accessories with white. If it's in a text document, it's gone. Because that means it's probably on my old computer. Let me look up BBA on my files. Nothing. Dressage. Nothing. Uh, we're gonna have to come up with new names for the Percheron teams, aren't we? 
At least I know the Frisian ones by heart. Team Velvet, Team Tidal are the two. Tidal, uh, not Tidal teams. Uh, Frisian team. Um, I don't know, because we I don't think we ever figured out the tack for the second team, but we figured out the coats for both. It's going to be this coat on the Pertrons for the secondary team. We could do... Oh, actually, that's a good... Actually, Evan, Evan. We could do Team Monarch, and we could have the Pertrons with these coats where orange accessories and black tack... And then I think the other Percher on team was Team Vanilla, but I could be wrong. Because I remember we were going to dress them up in pink, I think. Let me see if I can remember. Because if, if it was pink, I probably have random pink accessories in here. Hmm. I don't know. I don't remember. I think it was Team Vanilla, but I could be wrong. Also, speaking of, I want to test something. Get off your horse. Okay, apparently, from what Tem told me, is the vanilla bow, you can sell it now. Like, in marketplaces. Which, I don't know if that's just a bug, or what? My guess is a bug, because it's still not tradable. I'm gonna quickly check if I actually can. The code items have always been sellable to Larry, from what I'm aware. Okay. If you could, you can't anymore. I'm probably gonna end stream here in a minute though because it's already been like two and a half hours and I don't want to be streaming all night because inevitably I'm gonna crash again. am for you it is also 1 a.m for me all right i think i'm gonna end stream you guys want to stand with me while i end stream come here psst, psst. come stand with me any horse doesn't matter all right I'm gonna end stream. I hope you guys had fun. I will finish editing that dressage thing and I will post it. I promise. But I hope you guys have a good day or night. I will see you all later. Bye, guys.